Hi, everybody. This is Brad Nessler. With me, as always, Lee Corso and Kirk Herbstreit. It's a mild, clear day, so the weather won't be a factor in this battle between the LSU Tigers and the Wisconsin Badgers. EA Sports wishes you a safe and happy new year as we bring you this exciting college football game. And here come the Badgers. I'll tell you, this one can go either way. Kirk, what do you think will happen today? LSU is in a little bit of trouble defensively. Of course, the key to this game will be their ability to put pressure on the quarterback. He's very creative, and I think his ability to escape pressure and make big plays is why they'll win this football game. You know me, I decided my pick a couple of days ago. Wisconsin Badgers, they got this one. He sends it downfield. Houston fields it at the nine. Now let's see what kind of success this offense can have as they come out onto the field for the first time today. The They'll get the ball Bay here and will start quarter. the drive at the 21 yard line. First and 10. They line up in an eye. Looking to throw. He looks. He rolls out to the right. Throws to the middle. Incomplete. And the wideout had trouble holding on there. And I'll tell you what, he was holding on for dear life there. I don't think he was concerned about the ball too much on that play. Nah. Second From their 10. own 21-yard line. On the 21 Second yard down. Line. Wisconsin lines up in a bunch formation. And that defense is getting a little excited down there. All sides. On the defense. So they'll move them back after the penalty. I bet that one has the fans steaming. Uh, that wasn't a very bright play by that young man. You can bet that the fans aren't the only ones unhappy. His coaches don't look too happy either. From their own 26-yard line. Second down and five. Rodgers with the option. Laterals back. And he's tackled at the 33-yard line. That run gives him the first down. You know, in the media conference a couple of days ago, the coach talked about how important it was for them to establish the running game. Let's see if this helps them open up the passing game any. Wisconsin hasn't had any problems moving the ball down the field this year. This offense has been putting up points seemingly at will. No one's been able to stop them. The numbers tell the story, coach. They've been awesome. And he took a shot on that play, Brad. It looks like his head might be still ringing a little bit. From their own 21 yard line. Ball on the it's second down and 12 to go. LSU brings in their nickel package. Nelson brings him down at the 32. Crum gains about a yard on the play. They line up at the 32. Ball on the it's third and 11. Crum lines up in the deep back, I formation. Let's it fly. Great coverage, and it's intercepted. That was a nice interception. With the way that receiver was covered, that was an easy pick. They'll, They'll set up shot at the 49. The 49. Two tight First ends here. Ten. Here's the give. And he's level at the 47. I can't believe he held on to the ball after that hit. Yeah, and I don't even think he saw that hit coming. Right. 
second, it's second down and eight. Ball, ball on the 47, on the 47 yard line. Yard line. At the 41. Six yards on the carry. Look at how good this offense has been compared to the rest of the country. I say they're one of the best. Just look at those numbers. Wow. And they'll run them again. And he's all the way down to the 13. How about that for a statement? What a nice counterplay there. The line did a good job of blocking up front, and the tailback did the rest once he got by the first wave of defenders. Whoa, that was close to being six points there, you guys. LSU rarely comes away empty-handed once they get into the red zone. Brad, they have one of the best red zone percentages in the country. I'd be surprised if they didn't get some points on the board here as well. He throws it. It's complete. Smith with the tackle at the seven. So they execute and move a little closer to the sticks. Yeah, completing those short passes is the key because it lulls the defense to sleep a little bit. Then you can launch one big one downfield for a big game. From the seven-yard line, second down, four yards to go. LSU lines up with three receivers. He sheds it. He's taken off. Touchdown, Tigers! No one could break clear, so the QB decided to run it in. You've got to like it when your leader takes things into his own hands, especially down inside the tent. up for the PAT. And he adds the extra point. So we take a moment to check out the Pontiac drive summary. this one away. King and Houston back to return. He kicks off. King from his own end zone. He should have stayed in the end zone there. It looked like there was a little running room, but the lane closed up quickly. They'll go to work at the 15. Take over at the 15-yard line. First and 10. Rodgers with the give, tackle at the 17. He plows ahead for a two-yard gain. Second it's second down and eight. Ball on their own 17. They're in the eye. Rodgers gives it up the middle. A little juke. He's taken down at the 28-yard line. And the halfback ripped off a nice game there to get him the first. Hey, this kid's a good-looking back. Let's see if they go to him again. First and ten. First and ten. Ball on the 28. Ball on the 28-yard line. They line up in an eye. Crumb on the give. Brought down at the 31-yard line. Crumb gets three yards on the carry. That'll bring up second down. Second, second down seven. and seven. Ball on the 31. The Badgers come out in the ace formation. And they make the stop at the 33. He gains a couple of yards on the carry. Third, Third down, five. five yards to go. Ball on the 33. 
They're in the eye. Rodgers on play action. He's looking. Let's it go. That's incomplete. Houston was the intended target, and that'll bring up a punting situation. Fourth and five. It's fourth down All now, and we'll see the punt team. Line. Nelson is back awaiting the punt. He gets it off. Nelson takes it to 25. The offense is back on the field after that last touchdown drive. And let's see if they try to move the ball on the ground again. They'll First start down, the 10 to go. Ball on the 32-yard line. The defense is looking for the pass as they bring out their dime package. Nice play fake. It's deflected. That close to being intercepted. How about that defense? Well, that's why he's on the field, to make plays like that. So that'll make it second down. Second, second and 10. 10. Ball on the 32-yard line. Nelson is the deep back as they line up in the eye. Ellis drops to throw. He passes it. He snags it. Nelson fumbles. Defense has it. It's one of the corners. How'd he lose that football, Coach? I'll tell you how he lost it. He looked like the halfback was carrying the ball like an antique face or something. He can't do that. you got to carry it like it's a football. And they'll look to capitalize on the good field position here. Wisconsin comes to the line with three wide. He looks to throw on first down. It's complete. And down he goes at the 20-yard line. The defense looked a little lost on that one, Kirk. Yeah, they did, Brad. Nice recognition here by the quarterback to see that confusion and take advantage of it. We've got a first and 10. Ball on the 20. Rodgers with three wide receivers. First down, look at the throw. He's taken off, and he's taken down at the 12-yard line. Rodgers is walking off the field now, and the trainers are going to have a close look at him. Some coaches want to say mind over matter, but if you're hurt, you're hurt. Simple as that. Nothing you can do about it. Second, Second and two, two yards to go. The and they have three bunched. Looks to pass. Gets rid of it quickly. He's got an opening. Touchdown, Wisconsin. Outstanding play to the wide receiver as he took it the distance. It's almost if the receiver told the defensive back. You think you can cover me? I'll see you in the end zone. Guilty. The extra point to tie this game up. He splits the uprights with the extra point. And now we'll take a look at the Pontiac drive summary. They line up to kick this one away. He kicks it off. Ross fields at the goal line. So the offense comes out after their last drive. Had the ball end up in the defense's hands by way of a fumble. First the offense will start at the 17 yard line. Nelson lines up in the deep back. I formation brought down at the 21. That's four yards on the play. Second, second down and six. six to go. One man backfield. Ellis with the play fake looking. He flings it right. One's incomplete. 
Not much you can do there, Coach. Nope. Not much at all. It's not easy hanging on to the football when there's another guy coming at you. Those are going to be drops more times than not. Third We've got a third and six. six. Ball on the 21 yard line. LSU goes with the ace set here. Ellis back to throw. Jackson will make the sack. And guys, it can't feel good to be sacked by that guy. I saw him with a box of pizza last night. Then when he came off the bus this morning, he had more pizza. No wonder he's a giant. Yeah, Coach, he tipped the scales at over 300 pounds. And hey, as long as he keeps making plays like that, I don't care what he eats. Fourth and nine. The Tigers are lining up to punt it away. West awaits the snap. He gets it away. King fields it at the 40. The offense with a lot of success through the air on that last drive as they moved it down the field for the touchdown. The offense will take over at the 44. The Badgers. Line up with a single set backfield. Rodgers with the give. Got an opening. To the 20. And they finally knock him out at the 11-yard line. They pick up the first down and more on the carry. Boy, the offense got pretty lucky here. I thought they had him in the backfield. But hey, one open tackle later, and look where they end up. That's why these guys are taught to never give up on the Have a look at our Old Spice Red Zone numbers. Red Zone, when performance matters most. The Badgers come out in a two tight end set. Whoa, he just took a lick. He picks up a yard on the play. Second and nine. Ball on the 11. High formation here. Rodgers. Options left. Tackle at the one. He kept it himself and picked up a good looking first down. Another reason why I love the option. Just when you think he's going to pitch it, he cuts up the field and keeps the ball himself. No question, Coach. Great execution and a good decision there by the quarterback. They're in the red zone. First and goal. Ball on the one yard line. Let's see if they can punch this one in. They'll give it off here. Touchdown, Wisconsin! The halfback just plowed his way into the end zone. If it wasn't all him, the offensive line would just can't keep the defense on that one. So they're ready for the extra point. And he converts the extra point. And here's the Pontiac drive summary. Wisconsin is, is lining up to kick ball. this one off. Nelson and Ross back deep to return. He hits a booming kick. Ross from his own end zone. Not a very good series for this offense on their last drive as they were forced into a three and out. Boy, oh boy, they had nothing going last time. Yeah, maybe, Scooter, you need to get out there and show them what you're made of. Somebody get me a helmet quickly. The LSU it's Tigers first and ten. Will start ball on the 17-yard line. LSU line. comes to the line ten. with three wide. up knocked down incomplete the defense looked alive on that play yeah coach he did a great job of reading the play and beating the receiver to the ball that'll bring up second down Great. 
Second it's and second and ten. Ball on the ball on their own yard. 17. He's backfield, looking to throw, feeling the pressure. Kate was the intended target on the play. That'll make it third down. Third, third down and 10 coming up, ball on the 17-yard line. The Badger bringing the nickel package. Steps back to pass, throws it, catches it, tries to juke, and they make the stop at the 28. Nice play call to get them the conversion. When a team converts on third down, they can really frustrate a defense. When they converted third and long, it just makes them sick. First We've got 10. a first and 10. Ball, 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 ball on the 28-yard line. line. Nelson is the deep back as they line up in the eye. Inside gives. He's taken down at the 30. Nelson picks up two yards with a carry, so that'll make it second down. Second it's second down and eight. Ball on the 30-yard line. The defense comes out in the dime package. Ellis on play action. They brought him down for the sack at the 28-yard line. A little laundry on the field, and we'll find out whose it is. These are the calls that drive a coach crazy. Senseless penalties can sometimes be the difference between winning and losing the game. So we've got a second and long. long. Ball, Ball of the 20. 20 yard line. The Tigers come out in a shotgun. Looks to pass. He throws. Complete. Harmon brings him down at the 26. Well, Coach, a short pickup on that pass play. It was, but you know what? As long as they've got those guys getting open underneath, it'll take a lot of pressure off those offensive linemen who are trying to hold their guard. and 12. This defense Ball faces another third down. Yard. The offense lines up with three wide receivers. Ellis, back to pass. Wants to throw outside. Got his man on the run. Oh, boy. That is a nice play on third down. The quarterback found his receiver, and they connected on a big play. Big? That's an understatement, Kirk. This completion keeps the kick team off the field and gives them a new set of downs. First it's first ten. down. Yeah. LSU uh, sets up in the eye. Tackle made at the 47. Three-yard gain by the running back. Second it's and second seven. and seven. Ball on this the is the eighth play of this drive. Nelson lines up in a deep back, eye formation. Ellis drops back, steps up in the pocket. Look, Ellis goes down with a sack. They've been two for two on third downs in this drive and they'll try to convert again here. Ellis is back in the gun, stepping up, surveys the field. It falls incomplete. Pratt was the intended receiver on that pass, and they're going to have to bring on the punt team. Fourth and third. It's fourth down now, and we'll see the punt team. It's a high kick, and it holds up there. King fields it at the 18. Hardly tough sledding for this offense that last drive as they took it in for six. Well, look no further than the guys up front. They created some huge holes to run through. Right. 
They'll go to work at the 18-yard line. The Wisconsin Badgers will start the drive at the 18-yard line. First and 10. Wisconsin comes to the line, only one man in the backfield. Throws a bullet, has it to the senior. He ran a good-looking route and picked up positive yardage. That he did, and he made a good catch. That short passing game is where you see all those hours in the summer that you put in pay off. From their own 25-yard line, second down, three yards to go. Wisconsin sets up in the eye. Rodgers hands it off straight ahead. Simpson with a takedown at the 26-yard line. The fullback rumbles ahead for about a yard. Third they line up to the 26. Third down. Rodgers lines up in the shotgun. He throws left. And it's incomplete. So the defense gets him to go three and out. Good job here defensively forcing this incomplete pass. Fourth and two. The punt team is on the field looking to kick this one away. Nelson is the deep man awaiting the return. He punts it. Nelson fields it at the 38. I don't know if you guys saw this, but the coach gave his offense quite a speech before he sent him out there. And let's not forget, they had some things clicking the last time out. He's probably just reminding them to finish the job this time. They'll take over at the 42-yard line. First and 10. They're in the eye. Nelson gets it on the inside. Ball's loose, and he's taken down at the 44. They dodged a bullet right there, guys. Boy, did they. That halfback has got to keep both hands on the football. Coaches hate it when their running backs fumble the football. They are supposed to have the best hands on the football team. From their own 44-yard line, second down. LSU comes to the line, only one man in the backfield. He delivers, and this one falls incomplete. The defense got some pressure and forced a bad pass. I think they've been a little bit more aggressive here with their pass rush, and that time it paid off with an incompletion. Third and eight. eight. Ball on the 44 yard line. The Tigers line up with three wide. Ellis off the fake. He passes it. He snags it. Tackle at the 50. He made the catch, but he didn't get the first down. Yeah, right now, the way this defense is swarming, there's just no room for him to get upfield for the first down. Fourth and two. The Tigers oh, line up the front. West is waiting for the snap. He gets it away, and it's a skyrocket. King calls for the fair catch. The defense really run. shut these guys down the last time they had the ball. The run. offense looked a bit out of sync on that last possession, Coach. And it was the defense that threw them out of sync, Kirk. Those guys are fired up. Let's see if they can hold them again. The Wisconsin go to work Badgers at the take over at the 19-yard line. First and 10. The Badgers go with the eye formation. Crum gets the carry. He spins. Brought down at the 23-yard line. Crum gains about four yards on the play. From their own 23-yard line. It's second down and six to go. Roger comes to the line with three wide. Now he pitches it, and he's tackled at the 28. Crum gains about five yards on the run, so that'll make it third down. Third, Third down, one. a yard to Ball go. On the 28 yard line. The Badgers come out in a two tight end set. Rodgers off the fake. That it ball. Flowers was the intended target on the play. And that'll make it fourth down. Fourth, 
fourth and one. They line up to punt this one away. Nelson is back awaiting the punt. He punts it. Nelson takes it at the 33. The defense did a nice job of shutting down this offense the last time they had the ball. The offense was not clicking at all. Let's see if they're back on the same page. He'll take over at the 43 yard line. Start the drive at the 43 yard line. First and 10. Ace backfield. He looks to throw on first down. He tries to spin. Stiff tackles him behind the line for a loss on the play. Second it's second and 13. Ball, ball on the 40. 40 yard line. LSU comes out with an eye formation. He decides to run with it. And now he pitches it. Taylor with the tackle at midfield. They'll grab 10 yards there. Third, Third down and three, three coming up. Ball right around midfield. LSU goes with the ace set here. He's taken down at the 48. They don't pick up the first on that play. Brad, that defense is saying, not so fast, my friend. You're not going to run that ball that easy. Fourth and one. LSU ready to put this one away. Harmon back deep to return. He punts this one high in the air. Calls for the fair catch. So the offense takes over. And the last time they had the ball, they had a tough time getting anything going. They'll set up shots at the 11. Start the drive at the 11 yard line. First and 10. The Badger go with the eye formation. He's looking. Throwing left. Got his man on the run. This one might be coming back, folks. Let's check out the penalty. Flipping on the offense. 15 yard penalty. Still that one will put the offense in a hole, and they'll try to get some of that back on this upcoming play. They line up at the 17. First down. Crum is the single setback. Inside handoff. They'll bring him down at the 19-yard line. Crum gains about two yards on the run. That'll make it second down. They line up at the 19. All on the second 19-yard line. The defense sets up with five defensive linemen. Good open field tackle. And they keep it on the ground for the first down. Nothing too fancy here. The key is that the running back was able to convert the first down. They line up at the 22. It's first down. They line up in an eye. Rogers drops back. The senior makes the catch. Kirk, that was a nice grab there. You know, it may be simple, but whenever you can gain solid yardage, you're doing something right. Second, Second down, four. four yards to go. Ball on the 28-yard line. Crum, the lone back. Back to pass. Here's a quick throw. Spinning. He's tackled at the 36-yard line. So they go to the air and they pick up yet another first down. They've shown no problems moving the ball on this drive. This offense is moving the ball very well. And they're building some beautiful momentum along the way. We've got a first and 10. Ball on the 36 yard line. A long ways yet to go, but at the end of one, our score, Wisconsin 14, LSU 7.
First, First down, 10 to go. On the 36. On the 36. Ace backfield. Rodgers drops to throw. Over the middle. Got his man on the run. How about that pass, fellas? Well, Brad, the defense was coming with the blitz, and that opened some room for these guys to get open. Yeah, and if you're coming with the blitz, you better get to this quarterback. Otherwise, he'll make you pay. It's first and 10. The Badgers line up in an eye formation. Rodgers goes with the play fake, throws it out there. That's incomplete. Kirk. Yeah, Coach. Did you see that drop pass? Yeah, but it's safe to say that he heard footsteps, don't you think? I mean, the defender almost got there at the same time as the football. All right. Second well, the correct ten. answer is yes. Ball he did drop the football. Yard. Come on, sweetheart. The quarterback is trying to get you the ball. You got to make those kind of plays out there. Drops back to pass. Let's it fly. And it's the senior. And he's tackled at the 42-yard line. How about that play? That's a good pickup there. He just dropped back and delivered a nice throw. Third it's third and five. five. Ball on the 42-yard line. The defense is playing the pass on this one. Rodgers steps back to pass. Looking. Throws this one out to the left. It's complete. Brought down at the 25. That one worked pretty well. And it's a good job here by the wide receiver to get open. He created good separation from the defense. Let's take a look at the offensive production numbers. Brought to you by Coke. The Badger set up in the gun. Option left. Can't wrap him up. And now he decides to pitch it. What a drive this has been. They made about six stops along the way. One for every first down they've got. And that, my friend, deserves a yoke. Have a look at our Old Spice Red Zone numbers. Red Zone, when performance matters most. So their last Red Zone visit resulted in a touchdown. Let's see if the defense can hold them this time. They go with the option. Touchdown, Badgers! What a nifty, nifty run by the field general, guys. It sure was. He's got a lot of talent in those legs. They'll line up for the point after. He splits the uprights with the extra point. That score leads us to our Pontiac drive summary. Kicks off. Nelson from his own end zone. Juke move. Not a bad return. No, not bad at all. That's great field position. And any coach would tell you, good field position throughout the course of the game is very important. They'll we'll get the ball here at the 39. Line. First and 10. One man backfield. Ellis hands it off straight ahead. A yard, maybe two on the carry. From their own 41 yard line, it's second down and eight. The Tigers line up in an I formation. He drops back. He looks. Ellis slings it. His receiver has it. And he's brought down. So what do you think of this receiver after that play? 
quarterback made a nice throw, but it was the receiver who made this happen. That's a great way to make a statement. Yep, I think I would start to double cover this kid. He's just too dangerous. Here's the offensive production statistic, sponsored by Coca-Cola. The Tigers will come out in the ace formation. He unloads it. Someone got a hand on it. The corner comes up with a nice play, defending his own end zone. I'm not so sure he couldn't have come away with that interception that time. Good play, but I bet he's kicking himself for not catching that football. Second, Second down and 10 to go on the 34-yard line. The Tigers line up with three wide. Ellis drops to throw. Across the middle, he catches another. Excellent play as a quarterback found his receiver for a big game. Well, give credit here to the receiver for finding that seam and coming up with a nice game for the offense. Third, Third down and short. Ball on 24. 24 yard line. The Tigers line up in a goal line formation. Throws. It's deflected. And that was a good defensive play. Yeah, guys, this is because he's in great position to make the play. Four, four, looks like they're going to go for it on fourth down. The Tiger set up in the gun, looking to throw. He didn't get it. It's not even close. Not quite enough for the first. Looks like he'll turn it over on down. You know what? I think they still made the right call there. Yeah, it was worth the gamble, even though they didn't make it. They'll first down. The drive at the 27-yard line. First and 10. Wisconsin comes out with three receivers bunch. Sisk with a takedown at the 36-yard line. Second, Second down and around one to go. 36 yard 36. Line. Crum is the single setback. They'll wrestle him down in the backfield. Kirk, they really had nothing going on that run. I'll tell you what, Brad, it's almost like he ran into a brick wall on that play. Third and six. Ball on their own 31. The 31-yard line. This is when their star receiver can make play. Catches it, and down he goes at the 42. You know, Coach, the tight end is such a valuable weapon in the passing game. These days, they don't even recruit you if you don't have good hands at tight end. If you can't catch the ball, then they move you over to tackle. But this guy does have good size and good hands. And he just got them a first down. They're lining up in the 5-2. Rodgers on first down, moves up in the pocket. It's tipped. They can't connect. Incomplete. Excellent job of getting a hand in there to break up the pass. It was, Coach. That one had reception written all over it, but the defender stepped up and made the play. So that'll make it second down. Second, second down and 10 to go. On the 42-yard line. The Badgers are lining up with three receivers. Rodgers drops back. He passes it. Complete. Gets that one. And he's taken down at the 41-yard line. Guys, with that catch, he's now past the 1,000-yard point for the season. This guy has had a great year. The coach has got to be pleased with his performance for the year, Lee. Oh, yeah. He's a big, big part of their offense. We've got a first and 10. Ball on the 41. Going with the shotgun here. Rodgers. Back to pass. Rodgers lets it fly. Tackle at the 36. Short pass there, and they get a moderate gain. There's nothing wrong with nickel and diamond him down the field. Second, 
second it's second down. down. Ball on the 36-yard line. Rodgers set to go to the air. He's looking. Wants to throw outside. He catches another one. And they're building some great momentum on this drive, guys. That's right, Brad. That was a crisp pass by the quarterback. And they're looking pretty good moving the ball right now. First and ten. Ball on the 23-yard line. The Badger set up in the gun. Touchdown, Badgers! And that's his second rushing touchdown of the first half. And the head coach has to love the way this kid is running the football. There's a flag down, and here's the call. Unsportsmanlike conduct on the offense. 15 yard penalty. First on the charge. So the kicking team will line up for the point after. And he converts the extra point. And now we'll take a look at the Pontiac drive summary. Get set to kick this one away. He boots it deep downfield. Nelson from his own end zone. I don't think we'll see this offense get into a similar situation this time. So you think they'll convert on fourth down if they go for it again? Hey, why not? If you're having to go for it on fourth down a lot, you're not doing so hot, sweetheart. Here's the offensive production statistics, sponsored by Coca-Cola. They line up in the shotgun. Cut. Ellis on first down. Ellis unloads. Kate was the intended target, so that'll make it second down. Right. Second, second and 10. ten. Ball, Ball of the 18. On the, 18 the Tigers run. with four receivers. Ellis, back to pass. He lost the ball. Scooped up the loose ball. They bring him down in the backfield. Wow, very close to turning it over, but they'll keep possession of the football. Way to play heads up out there. That's just one more reason to play to the whistle. From their own 14-yard line, third down, 14 yards to go. They line up in an eye. Ellis steps back to pass. It's tipped. Almost picked off. Well, that was an impressive stand by the defense. Three good defensive plays equals punt. Nice job, guys. The Tigers line up the punt. King is back deep to return. He gets it off. King fields it at the 50. Well, the offense is back on the field again. In their last drive, they moved the ball very well, especially through the air on their way to that touchdown. First and 10, ball on the 37. The Wisconsin Badgers take over at the 37-yard line. First and 10. Surveys the field, and he's got him on the street. He's taken down at the 16-yard line. There's a flag on the play. Holding on the offense. 10 yard penalty. Still it's down. about time they called him for holding. He's been holding on to jerseys all game. Scooter, these refs could probably call holding on every play if they wanted to. These guys get away with a lot. 
First, first in a mile. Ball on the 47 yard line. Ace backfield. Rodgers on play action. Across the middle. Oh, what a spectacular grab. Whoa, whoa. He looked like Superman making that catch. What a great grab. Second, Second and 12, 12 coming up here. Ball on the 39 yard line. Rodgers will hand it off, and he's taken down at the 38-yard line. The fullback rumbles ahead for about a yard. They line up at the 38. Ball on Here's the 38-yard line. line. The Badgers set up in the gun. Rodgers back to throw. He throws. And he's got him on the fly. And they convert the third down with a long pass play. You're right, Brad. That was a long pass play. As a coach, you got to appreciate it when your players come out and perform like these kids are doing right now. And we take a quick look at the stats from within the red zone, brought to you by Old Spice Red Zone, when performance matters most. The Badgers come out in a two tight end set. Shake and bake move. Towns tackles him at the eight yard line. The fullback picks up about three yards on that carry. From the eight yard line. On the second down and seven to go. Wisconsin comes to the line, only one man in the backfield. Rodgers goes with a play fake. Touchdown, Wisconsin! Another touchdown. Why not? This just goes to show you that there is more to playing defense than emotion. You can't continuously play out of position like this. You're going to find yourself in a lot of mismatches. And today, those mismatches have turned into touchdowns. Here's the kicking team to try the extra point. And he adds the extra point. And now we're going to take a look at the Pontiac drive summary. Wisconsin to kick. Lined up for the kickoff. Here's the kick. Nelson from his own end zone. So before the offense hits the field, let's take the time to let you know that our game is brought to you by EA Sports. Let's take a look at the offensive production numbers brought to you by Coca-Cola. The Tigers come out in the ace formation. Drops back on first down. He throws it, and it's caught. And he's leveled. What a hit. Well, they pick up a few with a pass play, Coach. Yeah, it was. I like plays like these. As long as you're moving forward and not backward, you're doing pretty good. Second and five coming up here. Ball on the 25-yard line. LSU. Comes out with three receivers bunch. Here's the give. Jones with a takedown at the 26-yard line. Nelson picks up a yard on the play. Here's third down, four yards to go. On the 26-yard line. LSU will line up in a jumbo set here. Ellis with the play fake, lets it go. Got it ball. Black was the intended receiver on the play. That's going to bring up fourth down. Right. 
Fourth and four. The punter comes on the field, getting ready to send one off. King is back to receive. He gets it away. King fields it at the 34. Passing wasn't much of a problem the last time this offense had the ball as they were able to get it in for six. The West Coast down, down, 10 to go. At the ball on their own 37. Run. First and 10. Rogers drops back on first down. He throws it. He snags it. Six yards setback. It's second, second and long. long. Ball on their own 31. They're in the eye. Drops back to pass. Across the middle. It's complete. He has some room. Allen with the tackle at the 44. Not a bad pickup that time. Yeah, let me tell you the reason why this play worked. The defense came with pressure, but they couldn't quite get to the quarterback, and he made them pay right there. Third it's third down three. and three to go. Ball, Ball on the 44-yard line. Wisconsin lines up in a goal line Hold set. Hold on. Hold on. He jukes. Dunlap with a takedown at the 47. They convert the third down with that short run. It's first down. First and 10. Ball on the 47-yard line. The Badgers line up in an I formation. Setting up the play action. He tosses it short. Catches it. And they finally push him out at the 28-yard line. And that one was to the fullback. It's a pretty good play. I don't think anybody in the entire stadium anticipated the ball going to the fullback, but he showed soft hands and good speed that time. That's a big play. Let's take a look at the offensive production numbers. Brought to you by Coca-Cola. The Badgers come out in a shotgun. He drops back. Looks like he's going to run. And they make the stop at the 24. Second, Second and six, six coming up here. Ball on the 24-yard line from the gun. It's the tailback. Nice move. Brought down at the 19. So they get five yards there on the halfback draw. Have a look at our Old Spice Red Zone numbers. Red Zone, when performance matters most. LSU lines up in a dime defense here. Edwards with the tackle at the 17-yard line. The defense is having a difficult time stopping this drive. Right now, they're doing enough to be in situations they want to be in, but they have to finish the job. And the plays start to add First up. To we'll have to see if this Ball defense is still looks higher. Yard line. First and ten. We'll see what they can do in the red zone. Another run. And he's taken down at the 16-yard line. Pick up of a yard for the tailback. We're at play number nine of this current drive. Crum lines up in the deep back, I formation. To the end zone, and it's incomplete. You know, the quarterback didn't do anything wrong there. 
This is just a great play defensively. I think he underestimated the speed of the defensive player. He just shot in and broke it up. So that'll make it third down. Third so far nine. this drive, the defense has been unable down. to stop them on third down. Five DBs on the field. Rodgers steps back to pass. He'll take it himself. He's tackled at the 10. Five, maybe six yards there on the scramble. It's four down. And the field goal unit's out to try this 27-yarder. They're already up big, and this could make the lead bigger. It's up, and it's good. So we take a moment to check out the Pontiac Drive Summary. Wisconsin to kick this one off. Nelson and Ross back ready to return. He kicks it. Nelson from his own end zone. The offense gets ready to start a new drive as they just couldn't get anything going on their last possession. Going three and out. They'll go to work at the 20-yard 20, 20 line. First and 10. The Tigers line up with a single setback to you. Looking. And now he's going to improvise. They line up at the 21. And second down and nine to go. The Tigers come out in a shotgun. Option to the right. He's gobbled up in the backfield. Great. They line up at the 17. Third down. Great. LSU comes out with three receivers bunch. He delivers, and he's got him on the run. They convert on third and long, guys. With the offense coming through in a big way that time, how about the timing on that route, Coach? Yeah, Kirk, the quarterback was able to throw to a spot, and the receiver was there to catch it for a first and ten. Nice play. First, first and ten. ten. Ball, Ball on their own 38-yard line. Ellis with three wide receivers. Ellis drops back on first down. The defender had his hands on it, but it's incomplete. Good defense there, guys. I wonder if the quarterback was expecting to see man coverage there because he threw it right to the defense. And that's what's so tough about playing against a zone. You think a guy's open, and out of nowhere, a defender shows right, up. Second and like that. Second and ten. LSU comes out in the shotgun, drops back to pass. Loose football. Nelson with a recovery. Well, they avoided a turnover right there. Man, oh man, that was a close one. Good thing that kid was paying attention and fell on the football. Third they line up five. at the 43. Ball on the 43 down. Defense. LSU comes to the line with three wide. He's looking for his man. That's incomplete. Intense pressure on the quarterback that time. Well, he made a bad throw, and he's very lucky to keep possession. Fourth and five. LSU on the ready to put this one away. King is the deep man awaiting the return. West. Punts it away, and this is just a beauty. Great kick. King takes it to 12. Just couldn't break free on that one. Now, Brad, he didn't have a lot of open field to run, but he did a nice job of making something out of nothing. First, 
First down, 10 yards to go. Three wideouts here. Rodgers drops back on first down. Got it to his receiver. And down he goes at the 34. Boy, does this kid have an arm or what? Are you kidding me? It looks like he has a rocket launcher attached to his shoulder. Let's take a look at the offensive production numbers. Brought to you by Coke. Rodgers will hand it off. Makes a move. Brought down at the 35. Maybe a yard on the run by the tailback. Wisconsin will take their first time out of the half. Two minutes to go in the half. Wisconsin comes out with an eye formation. Give to the tailback. Juke move. Sisk brings him down at the 43. Crum gets eight yards on the play. Third and one. Ball on the 43-yard line. Rodgers comes to the line with three wide. He gets another carry. Town with the tackle at the 49-yard line. And a nice run by the tailback. Not a lot of razzle-dazzle here, but it gets the job done and picks up the first down. First down, 10 yards to go. Ball on the 49. Crum alone in the backfield. Setting up play action. He looks. He'll dump this one off. He's pushed out of bounds at the 48. They complete the play action pass for a pickup of three. Second, Second and seven, seven coming up here. Ball, ball, ball right around midfield. The Badger come out in the ace formation. Across the middle. He's taken down at the 41-yard line. Gained seven yards with a catch there. And it keeps the wheels turning on this drive. They line up at the 41. First and 10. First down. Ball on the 41-yard line. Rodgers is back in the gun. Inside handoff. Tackle made. At the 40, Wisconsin will take a timeout. That's their second of the half. Second and nine. The Badger go with the eye formation. Rodgers fakes the handoff. The big guy with room to run. Only three yards there on the throw. Third, Third down and, and six, six yards to go. And this is the ninth play of the current drive. Yeah. Wisconsin comes to the line, only one man in the backfield. Hot. They'll throw again. Defense hasn't stopped them yet. Throws it out there. Spin moves. And he's taken down at the 32. I don't really know what this one's for. Let's find out. Holding on the offense. They'll call on the field goal unit here for this long field goal attempt. This kick will be about a 49-yarder. They're already up big, and this could make the lead bigger. It's up, looks long enough. They got to it. And that's just a super special teams play. Brad, the defensive line got great penetration, 
allowing him to push through and get a hand on the kick. They'll go to work at the 32-yard line. Over at the 32-yard line. First and 10. The Tigers line up in an eye formation. Ellis on first down. Let's it fly. Caught. Washington tackles him behind the line for a loss on the play. And they lose a couple there. Still got a half of football remaining, but our score at halftime is Wisconsin 38, LSU 7. And the teams are lined up to start the second half. Off to start the second half. He kicks off. Ross fields it in the end zone. And now a slight break in the action as the offense comes out onto the field for their next possession. The First LSU down, Tigers 10 yards to go. Will start the drive at the 26-yard line. First and 10. Nelson is the deep back as they line up in the eye. Ellis to the air on first down. That is ball. The defender had it and then dropped it. Boy, that was a good defensive effort there. The ball was there, but the defender beat the receiver to it. Nice play. That'll make it second down. Second it's second down. The Tigers go with the I formation. Flags are all over the place, and they'll blow it dead. Dead ball. Won't start on the offense. Five point penalty. Still Man, second line. These are frustrating penalties, coach. You need to discipline these players. Otherwise, they keep making stupid penalties. Your Second players probably never committed any penalties, right? Oh, the oh yes, they line. did. But they paid the consequences. And he's hammered as he lets it go. They can't connect. Incomplete. And it looks like there's an injury down there on the field. It doesn't look like it's too bad, but the trainers are going to take a look anyway. Third, Third and 15, 15 coming up, all of the 21 yard line. Yard line. Ace backfield, back to pass. Looks, throwing left. This one is incomplete. You can't expect to get a good drive when you're unable to complete any passes. That's exactly why this one didn't get him any points. Fourth and 15. LSU, ball ready to put this one away. West awaits the snap. Punts the ball away. King fields it at the 41. Time once again for this offense to come back out and start another drive. First down, 10 yards to go. Over at the ball of their own 44. First and 10. Wisconsin lines up in a bunch formation. And he's tackled at the 50-yard line. A gain of six. Second it's second and four to go.
Wisconsin goes with the ace set here. Little handoff. And down he goes at the 50. Not much for the runner as he gets back to the line of scrimmage. Third, Third down, four, four yards to go. On the 50 they yard line up at the 50. Crum lines up in the deep back, high formation. That's a great tackle at the 48. Not a very successful run that time, Coach. Did you see his explosion off the defensive line? Woohoo! It seemed like he was in the backfield before the ball was even right, snapped. Seconds. He just timed the snap ball count the there. He really made a nice play. Yeah. Schmidt is waiting for the snap. He punts this one high in the air. Calls for the fair catch. And now we'll see the offense come out out of the field for their next position. They'll start the drive at the 19-yard line. First and 10. Ellis lines up in the shotgun. He drops back. He passes it. Interception off the deflection. Touchdown, Badger. And that interception might be what they needed to get back in this ball game. Nice try, Brad. Keep their hopes up, but I don't think they have a chance of winning this. They're too far down to catch up. They'll line up for the extra point. And he adds the extra point. So with just over 13 minutes remaining in the third quarter, the score is Wisconsin 45, LSU 7. Wisconsin ready to kick this one off. Nelson and Ross deep to return. Kicks off. Ross from his own end zone. So before the offense hits the field, let's take the time to let you know that our game is brought to you by EA Sports. They'll it's take first and 10. Ball on the 16-yard line. First and 10. Comes to the line with three wide. Ellis delivers, and he's got him on the fly. Nice little pitch and catch with a wide out. Well, the quarterback and receiver spend a lot of time together. The coaches say they stay after practice, just working on their timing, and right there it paid off. First From their 10. own 35-yard line. First down. Yeah. LSU comes to the line with three wide. down at the 50-yard line. And the tailback picks up great yardage on the run. How many times did we see him run that play in practice this week? <laughs> a thousand times. And it was just as successful then as it is right now. Here's a look at the offensive production statistics brought to you by Coke. LSU sets up in the eye. Ellis drops back to pass. He snags it. Nice little pattern there. Yeah, he had great position there. And that ball was thrown in the right spot. Second it's second down and five to go. Ball, ball, ball on the 45-yard line. The Tigers are lining up with three receivers. They go with a toss. Halfback pass. That's a great tackle at the 50. That's a loss of about five. Right. 
We've got third and ten. They line up at the 50. Third and the and Tigers. Ten. Line up Ball in an eye formation. The 50 yard line. Yeah. Ellis steps back to pass. Steps up. Look out. Complete. Taylor brings him down for a loss. Taken back a yard. Fourth and 11. LSU ready to punt this one away. King will be the return man. It's a high kick and it holds up there. King signals for a fair catch. And now a slight break in the action as the offense comes out onto the field for their next possession. The, the offense will start at the 15-yard line. At the 15-yard line. First and 10. Crum gets the call. Sisk with a takedown at the 22. Crum picks up about seven yards on the run. From their own 22-yard line. Ball on the 22 it's second down. Line. Single set backfield. Chrome takes a handoff. Fumble, loose ball. And he just got drilled. The offense will keep possession after the fumble by the running back. It's a good thing they can't afford a turnover right now. Third, Third down and two. And two. Ball on the 23. yard line. Rodgers with three wide receivers. He's into the open field. And they make the stop on the 38-yard line. Here's a look at the offensive production statistics brought to you by Coke. Wisconsin comes out with an eye formation. Krum gets the call. Ford tackles him at the 46-yard line. A nice job by the offensive line, and they pick up a gain of eight. Second, Second down. Ball on the 46-yard line. Wisconsin sets up in the eye. Rodgers sets up the play action. Got it. And he's taken down at the 25-yard line. Interesting call. The defense came with the that time. Problem was they couldn't quite get to the quarterback. And when you can't quite do something, that means the other guys will probably have a big play. <laughs> And you're right, that pass was good for a bunch of yards that time. First down, 10 to go. Ball on the 25. Ace backfield. Crum takes the toss left. They'll knock him down for a loss. Loss of two for tackle. Loss of two on the play. Second it's second and down and 12. Ball on the, Ball on the 27. Yard line. High formation here. Rodgers with the give. He's tackled at the 21. Crum gains around six yards on the run. So that'll make it third down. Third so another third six. down upcoming Ball for the offense. Yard line. LSU comes out defensively with six defensive backs. Hand off to the right. Tackle made at the 21-yard line. Not much for the runner as he gets back to the line of scrimmage. Three. 
So it's fourth, fourth down. Six. This one is Ball from 38 yards away. This will just add insult to injury. He gets it up, and he got it. And now we'll take a look at the Pontiac Drive summary. Looks ready, ready to kick this one, one off. Kick off. And it's off. Ross from his own end zone. They're just about ready to get this drive started. After their last series had some promise, but it ended with a punt. They'll take it's first down. The 20 yard line. First and 10. The Tigers line up with a single set back to you. Nelson on the inside handoff. Oh, he got nailed on that one. He picked up around three yards on the draw play. Second, Second down. Seven. Nelson is the deep back as they line up in the eye. Down the middle. Got him on the run. The 50. At the 40. At the 30. To the 20. To the 10. He's all the way. Touchdown. Guys, how fast is this kid? Well, it's pretty simple. You can see it right there. Nobody on the field can stay with this field. I don't think anybody in the country can keep up with this guy. He's out there playing. Catch me if you can. They'll line it up for the extra point. And he converts the extra point. And now we're going to take a look at the Pontiac drive summary. He sends it downfield. Houston from his own end zone. A good job on their last drive, getting three. Let's see if they can get some more on this drive. Here's the offensive production statistics, sponsored by Coca-Cola. From the gun. He throws. And it falls incomplete. I'm a little surprised that he dropped that one, Coach. I am too, but don't take anything away from this defense. That was a perfectly timed hit. There wasn't much the receiver could do that time. He had a man in his face as soon as he touched the football. Second, Second down. Ball on the 24-yard line. Rodgers is back in the gun. Rodgers drops back. Steps up in the pocket. He's going to take off. And he's tackled in the open field. Third, Third in the couple. Two. Ball on the 32. 32-yard line. The Badgers come out showing three wide. Off the right side. He breaks it. McMahon 
Brings him down at the 48. How about that conversion on third down? Good push here by the guys up front, and they are really starting to work hard in the trenches. Let me tell you something. The biggest compliment you can give a coach is that his team is playing hard. And you're right. These guys are playing First real hard Ball on right the 48 now. yard line. First down. Wisconsin comes to the line, only one man in the backfield. He lets it go. Allen with a takedown at the 47 yard line. Nice little catch there, huh, coach? Yeah, that was a good call. I like that call. I like short passes. They're safe and can lead to some really good yardage. They line up at the 47. Ball on Second the down and five. Crum lines up in the deep back. Eye formation. Rodgers passes. It falls incomplete. There's a flag down on the field, and I'm betting that this one is pass interference. Pass interference on the defense. Spot foul. First down. Well, he got busted for getting to the receiver too soon. He will get a flag thrown on him every time for a play like that. First, First ten. down, 10 yards to go. Ball on the 40. Wisconsin lines up in a bunch formation. They'll throw on first down. Throw short. He snags it. Tackle at the 39. They couldn't get much out of that one. I loved how that defense just swarmed to the ball the second it was thrown. They line up at the 39. We've got second and nine here. Single set backfield. Brought down at the 32-yard line. They keep it on the ground, and the halfback gets about seven yards. Third so another two. third down upcoming for the, the offense. On the 32-yard line. Wisconsin lines up in a shotgun set. Rolls right. Throws down the middle. Got it to his receiver. The defense is coming with heat on that play. Yeah, but the offensive line did a good job of picking up their assignments. That gave the quarterback enough time to throw a nice pass to pick up the first down. And we take a quick look at the stats from within the red zone, brought to you by Old Spice Red Zone, when performance matters most. The Badgers line up in an I formation. Here's the halfback. Nelson with the tackle at the four. Crum gains seven yards on that play. From the four-yard line, the second down and three to go. Let's see if they can get it in for the touchdown. He's in another touchdown. And that's his third score on the ground today. Boy, this guy's been huge today. It's been a big part of the reason that his team has the lead. Well, you have to have faith in your running back, Kurt. And you're right, this kid is a big reason why this offense has been very successful today. They'll line up for the extra point here. He makes the PAT. That score leads us to our Pontiac drive summary. Wisconsin gets set to kick this one away. And it's off. Ross fields it in the end zone. 
Guys, their last possession, they really had good success passing the ball. Hey, if you ask me, I'd air it out some more. Hey, I agree. Make them show you that they can stop it before you change things up. Here are the offensive production stats brought to you today by Coca-Cola. LSU in a four-wide set. Ellis to the air on first down. He throws right. Pratt was the intended target on the play. That'll bring up second down. Second it's second and ten. And ten. Ball, ball, ball on their own 16. Yeah. Ellis drops back to pass. Stepping up. Throws it. Catches it. And he's tackled at the 27-yard line. What did you see there, guys? The defense was in zone coverage. The offense did a good job of protecting the quarterback, and he threw a nice ball to get the first down. And the receiver ran a nice route to get open between the zone coverage. First, first and 10. ten. Ball, ball on their own 27-yard line. Yeah. LSU oh. comes out of the shotgun. He's taken down at the 29-yard line. About two yards there on the fullback draw. Second, Second down. Ball on the 29-yard line. The defense comes out in the dime package. Ellis with the play fake. He throws it. It's complete. And he's tackled right away. And a nice pickup through the air. I'll tell you what, fellas. I love this kid's throwing ability. He's got a quick release, and he's very accurate. They line up at the 33. Ball on the third and three-yard line. The Tigers line up with a single set back to you. He drops back. Wants to throw outside. And he's taken down at the 46-yard line. And Herbie, that was a good-looking throw. Yeah, and what impresses me is the composure of this young quarterback. He made a great read, saw the open receiver, and delivered an almost perfect strike. Good-looking play. First, First, First down, 10, 10 to go. On the 46. The, 46. the Tigers come out in the shotgun. Here's the option. Spin move. And they got him for a loss. 93 with the tackle. One-yard loss on the play. Second, Second down and 11 yards to the sticks. Yeah. Ellis with three wide receivers. Cut. Ellis drops back to pass. He lets it go. Someone got a hand on it. Good job there by the defense to get a hand on it. It was, Kirk, but when you're going out for a pass and the ball is in the air, you need to go after it and come down with it. You just can't watch the defender Third and it down. Up. The, the offense faces another third down as they line it up. The Badger line up in a nickel back. Ellis steps back to pass, surveys the field. He throws right, and he's finally knocked out of bounds at the 30. Well, he almost had it, but tight ends usually aren't the most graceful players on the field. Fourth and 11. LSU oh, lining up the punt. King, the return man. Punt. He punts it away. It's a high kick. King calls for the fair catch. They get the ball back after a touchdown on their last possession. And the reason why they scored last time was because of the way they ran the football. Yeah, you're right, Lee. They drove almost the length of the field. Let's see if they can put some more points up on the board. They'll start at the 14. Rogers will hand it off. He's tackled at the 16. Lee, what do you think of that run? Yo, is this running back having a tremendous game or what? You just don't run for over 200 yards and call it an average day. Ha! Wisconsin sets up in the eye. All on the 16-yard line. 
shot. Rodgers, back to throw. Across the middle, and he brings it down. That's a first down right there. Yeah, if I was the defense, I think I would man up on these guys next time. This quarterback is very good at recognizing his own coverage and then finding the open receiver. From their own 31-yard line, first, first down. down. Ball on the 31-yard line. High formation here. Crumb gets another carry. Sisk with a takedown at the 39. Eight yards on the counter there. From their own 39 yard line. On the 39 in second and two. The Badger come out showing three wide. He'll dump it short. And it's caught. Steps out of bounds at the 47-yard line. That's now 300 passing yards for this quarterback, Coach. This guy's having a huge game. Solid. And I'll tell you why. This offensive line has given him plenty of time to throw the ball back there. First and 10. Ball on the 48. And they have three bunched. Looking to throw. Rodgers throws. Got him again. Tackle at the 34-yard line. Kirk, what do you have for us? Well, that catch put the receiver over 100 yards. He's been one of the quarterback's favorite targets all game long. First down, 10 yards to go. Ball on the 34-yard line. Rodgers, back to pass. Under pressure, and he's going to be sacked. Second and long coming up here. Ball, ball, ball on the 40-yard 40 40 line. line. LSU brings in the nickel here. Rodgers rifles it. They'll bring him down at the 25-yard line. And that catch puts him at 60 for the season. That just shows you how good this kid's been all year long. From the 25-yard line, we've got third down and one. Single set backfield. They hand it off again. Allen with the tackle at the six-yard line. And that'll give him another first down. Excellent job there, Brad, of running the football. That was good execution by this offense. Now we take a quick look at the stats from within the red zone, brought to you by Old Spice Red Zone when performance matters most. Defense looking for his first incomplete in this drive. He snags it. No gain. Heading to the fourth quarter. This one is well in hand. With the score, Wisconsin 55, LSU 14. They line up at the six. That brings up second and goal. They'll bring in their dime package. Lovelady set to go to the air. He looks. He unloads it. Complete. He's tackled at the six. Back to the line of scrimmage, and that's it. Third, Third and goal. goal. Ball, Ball on the, on the six. six. Wisconsin comes out with an eye formation. Setting up the play action. Going to the end zone. Come on, sweetheart. What are you doing? You don't have to rub it in like this. Yeah, coach, but then again, it is their job to stop this offense. I mean, they can't help if their plays are working so well. Well, if that's the case, then I hope they schedule these guys again because there's nothing sweeter than getting revenge on a team that likes to run up the score. They line up for the extra point. Uh, 
He splits the uprights with the extra point. So we take a moment to check out the Pontiac drive summary. Wisconsin to kick this one off. Kicks it off. Nelson from his own end zone. Guys, what do you think about this situation? Hopefully we'll see the offense move this ball up the field a little bit. Yeah, Coach, they really haven't had too much success today. But this is an opportunity for them to get their team back on track and build some confidence going into the next game. The Tigers come out in the ace formation, drops back to pass. Ellis throws, and that one's incomplete. The ball is roughly separated from the receiver by the defender. And that's the way you play defense, rough and tough with no apologies. Second it's second down and 10 to go. Ball on the 23-yard line. And they make the stop at the 28-yard line. A five-yard pickup for the tailback. They line up at the 28. It's third and five. The Tigers come out showing three wide. Looks. Ellis delivers. And it's caught. Williams tackles him for a loss on the play. So there was just nothing doing on that series, and they go three and out. Give some credit to the defense there. They came out to the field fired up, and they held their ground in that series. Four and seven. So they're set to punch this one away. Fry back deep to return. He gets it away. Fry fields it at the 34. What to look for on this drive is to see how often the defense changes up its coverages. They didn't defend the pass very well that last drive, so it's going to be interesting to see if they play them differently here. The They'll take over at the 39-yard line. At the 39-yard line. First and 10. With the game well in hand, they're going to get the other quarterbacks in playing time. And he's taken down at the 46. Just a minute, folks. There's a penalty on that play. Personal foul. Face mask on the defense. 15 yards from the spot of the foul. He took him down using his face down. mask, and that'll be a 15-yarder. You betcha. And that's the worst way to bring a man down. March it off, refs. First, First and 10. 10. Ball on the 31-yard line. Wisconsin comes to the line, only one man in the backfield. They keep it on the ground with the tailback. Didn't get Number anything. 20, the ball carrier, no gain on the play. Second, Second ten. down, 10 yards ball to go. On the 31. Ball yard on the, 31. the Badgers set up in the gun. Direct snap to the back. There's a very impressive open field Twenty. tackle with the carry. Lafita. Gained seven, seven yards on that play. So that'll make it third down. Third it's third and, and three. three. Ball, Ball on the 24-yard line. Yard line. The Badgers go with the I formation. Lafita takes the toss left. Nelson gets in the backfield for a loss. That Five blitz was coming loss. pretty hard that time, Kirk. There was just nowhere for the running back to go. Great penetration by this defense. They'll call on the field goal unit here for this the long field goal attempt. The ball's on the 29, so this will be about a 46-yarder. They're already up big, and this could make the lead bigger. 
The kick is up. And the field goal is good. Not a bad kick to get your team three points, Kirk. Yeah, he got some good leg behind it, and he kicked an accurate ball right between the goalposts. Wisconsin gets set to kick this one away. Nelson and Ross set to return. He just drills this one. Ross fields it in the end zone. They've been getting walloped all day, but at least they're still working hard. I like a team that never quits. We've got a first and ten. Ball on the 20. Tries to do it. Blair with a takedown at the 24-yard line. Four-yard gain by the back. Second, Second and six, six coming up here. Ball, ball on, on their own 24-yard line. line. The Tigers come out in the ace formation. Right. And they'll bring him down behind the line. Great pursuit by the defense to stop the outside run. Yeah, the halfback was trying to get to the corner, but he had no luck at all there. Third, it's third and down seven. and seven to go. Ball on the 23-yard line. LSU goes with the ace set here. Looks, fires across the middle. His receiver has it. And down he goes at the 37-yard line. Good pickup by the receiver. Yeah, this kid loves to play. He wants the ball every time they throw it up. First, first and ten. Ball, ball on the 37-yard line. Yard line. The defense lines up with six DBs. Let's it fly. He's got his tight end. Tackle made at the 46. The tight end with a nice catch there. First We've got ten. a first and ten. Ball on the, Ball on the 46. Yard line. LSU in a four wide set. He passes it that close to being intercepted. How about that defense? Well, that's why he's on the field, to make plays like that. That'll bring up second down. Second, and second down and ten to go. Ball on the 46 yard line. LSU goes with the ace set here. Looks to pass. Across the middle. Pratt just couldn't bring it in. Pratt was the intended receiver on that pass. That'll make it third down. Third so another third ten. down upcoming for the offense. Six yard line. LSU comes out in the shotgun. Back to pass. Throws it out there. It's complete. Fry tackles him for a loss on the play. Taken back a yard. LSU, ready to push this one away. West punts it, and he really got a leg into this one. Johnson signals for a fair catch. The, the offense goes back out onto the, the field after picking up a field goal on their last drive. They'll, They'll set up a shot at the 20-yard line. First and 10. Fafita is the deep back as they line up in the eye. Love Lady gives it up the middle. He's tackled at the 23-yard line. That's a three-yard pick yard gain on the play. Second, 
Second they line up at the 23. On the 23 Second down. Yard line. Wisconsin sets up in the eye. Love Lady. Still has it. Throws. And he can't hang on to it. Not much you can say there. He just dropped it. Yep. He was thinking about what he was going to do after the catch before he even had the ball in his hands. Yep. That's pretty easy to do when you're that third far and over. Seven. It's third and seven. Ball on the 23-yard line. Wisconsin lines up in a shotgun set. Love Lady. Back to throw. Edwards tackles him at the 25. So there was not much doing on that pass play, and that's going to bring up fourth down. Fourth and five. The punter comes on the field, getting ready to send one off. Nelson is back deep to return. He punts it. He dropped it. He's hit and got away. He just couldn't pull that one in clean. And Brad, that's what happens when you take your eyes off the ball. This was an error that should have been avoided. The offense will take over at the 38 yard line. First and 10. The Tigers line up with a single set back to you. Dives and caught. The defense was coming with heat on that play. Yep, but the offensive line did a good job of picking up their assignments, and that gave the quarterback enough time to throw a nice pass to pick up the first down. First it's first ten. down. First down, looking to throw. He delivers, and he's got him on the street. And with that last pass, Coach, this quarterback's gone over 300 yards for the game. A very impressive performance indeed. First, First down. Ball on the 28-yard line. Nelson alone in the backfield. Throws it to the outside. Got him again. Howard with a takedown at the seven. And fellas, this is really turning into a very impressive drive. Three first downs and counting on this drive, Kirk. Yeah, they've done a good job of building some momentum here. And more importantly, they've kept this defense on the field. And since we're in the red zone, let's have a look at the numbers. Brought to you by Old Spice Red Zone when performance matters most. Don't be surprised if the tight end gets some six on this drive. Nelson on a counter. Williams with the tackle at the seven yard line. Didn't get anything. Second and they're only seven yards away from the end zone. The Tigers go with the eye formation. Ellis hands it off. No, play fake. Ellis lets it go. Big play by the defense. That's why they call him a safety, because he's the last line of defense. Right there, he protected the end zone. What a throw. Third and let's goal. see how the quarterback handles this one. It's third and goal from the seventh. The Badger bring in their dive package. Ellis drops back. Under heavy pressure. Fires. It falls incomplete. What a close call for this defense. You're absolutely right. You're not going to see him drop the ball like that too often. What a break for the defense. Fourth, and here we go from the seven. It's fourth down. LSU comes to the line with three wide. Ellis back to throw. Fires to the end zone. Touchdown, LSU. And did that play ever develop nicely? And it's all about the receiver on this play. He beat his man off the line and then ran a perfect route. All he had to do after that was make the catch. And 
And they line up for the point after. And he tacks on the extra point. A little laundry on the field, and we'll find out whose it is. Holding on the offense. Ten yard penalty for the beaten trial. Now they'll try to tack on the extra point. He makes the PAT. And now we'll take a look at the Pontiac Drive Summary. Ready to kick it away. Fry and Fafita back to return. Kicks it off. Fafita from his own end zone. Well, moving the football hasn't yards. been a problem all game. Yeah, but this one's in the books, coach. I expect him to run the ball, kill the clock, and put this one in the books. Here's a look at the offensive production statistics brought to you by Coca-Cola. give. Simpson brings him down at the 26-yard line. The fullback picks up about three yards on that carry. Second, Second down, seven, seven yards to go. On the 26-yard line. line. Bunch formation. Love lady. Still has it. Let's it go. And it's caught. And he is drilled at the 39-yard line. Oh, man, they had him good there. The defense was looking run, and they threw it for a big game. The running back really sold the run well that time. That allowed for the quarterback to get the ball downfield for a decent game. They line up at the 39. It's first down. Lovelady. Flips it out. Good open field tackle. And the offensive line did a good job of picking up the blitz. Yep, the defense over pursued the play, and it helped them get some good yards. Second and one. Ball right around midfield. The Badgers line up in an eye formation. Bang, gets the call. And he's tackled at the 48. That's a pretty nice run there. Yeah, for a first down, too. Yeah, anytime you can get production like this from the fullback, you give the defense something else to worry about. First down, 10 yards to go. Ball right around midfield. The Badgers go with the I formation. Here's the halfback. They'll bring him down at the 41-yard line. The feeder gains seven yards on that play, so that'll make it second down. They line up at the 41. Second down. The Badgers line up in an eye formation. He jukes him. He tackles him for a loss. 20, with that toss area. had no room to work as the defense the had the hot pursuit. Man, they just scorched the field to get to him. I can see where the turf is gone. Third From the 42-yard line. Ball on the it's third down and four to go. Wisconsin comes out with an eye formation. Mofita on a pitch out. Excellent open field tackle. So with that run, they pick up another first. It's a nice job again up front by the offensive line. They're doing a good job of neutralizing the defensive front. And it's allowed them to move the ball down the field. 
First and ten. The Tigers line up with six defensive backs. Lafita gets it on the pitch. They'll get him for a loss. The toss play loses a yard. One yard loss on the play. Second, Second and down. 11. Ball on the 38 yard line. The defense lines up with six DB. Over the middle. And it's picked off. And he's taken down at the 47. Lee, do you think they'll be able to capitalize on the interception? I don't know. I don't think it's going to make much difference. They've dug themselves in a pretty big hole. They'll, They'll start over at the 47 yard line. yard line. First and 10. They line up in the shotgun. Let's it fly. He snags it. And they make the stop at the 45 yard line. Looked like the linebackers bid on that play fake. I didn't even know the quarterback had the ball. That's worth a yoke. From the 45-yard line, second and two. They come out with three wide receivers. A little juke brought down at the 32-yard line. And that was a nice run. Kirk, that was a great job by that big offensive line. Yeah, it really was, Brad. And also, a nice read by the ball carrier to find that running lane. When you break one like that, you got to give a lot of credit to the offensive line. Let's take a look at the offensive production numbers. Brought to you by Coca-Cola. Nelson is the single setback. Nelson on the give. Fry with a takedown at the 24. And he goes over the century mark with that run, guys. You know, Brad, he's had a great day, but credit the offensive line for fine blocking all game long. Second, Second and two yards to go. Ball on the 24-yard line. One man backfield. Ellis hands it off. Williams tackles him at the 23. Pickup of a yard for the tailback. We've got third down and one. Ball on the 23-yard line. And they better keep an eye on that tight end. Ellis is going to be sacked for a loss. And there's sack number six on the day. Kirk, who's at fault here? The O-line for not blocking well or the quarterback for not getting rid of the football? I'd say you can blame both the offensive line and the quarterback. But don't forget about the receivers. They're not helping matters. They're not getting open. So you're seeing a lot of coverage sacks as well. It looks like they've decided to go for it here. Bunch formation. Drops back to pass. Steps up. He throws left. Complete. And they push him out at the eight. They pick up solid yardage there. Yeah, nice little pitch and catch there. The wideout was able to find a little open space in the defense. And the quarterback was able to get him the ball for a good pickup. And since we're in the red zone, let's have a look at the numbers. Brought to you by Old Spice Red Zone, when performance matters most. LSU lines up with three receivers. Sean, back to pass. He'll dump it short. Catches it. Touchdown! My goodness, guys, that was a spectacular play by the wide receiver. The coach has gone to great lengths to shepherd his receivers, and we've seen the results on the field. So they're ready for the extra point. Yeah. Uh -huh. 
And he tacks on the extra point. That score leads us to our Pontiac drive summary. Well, not much of a choice here. They need to go for the onside kick. Here's the onside kick. I expect to see some good clock management right here. Yep, coach. They've already warmed up the buses for the end of this game. They'll, They'll take, take over, over at the 33-yard line. First and 10. ten. High formation here. Love Lady will hand it off. He's tackled at the 41 yard line. Lafita gets eight yards on the play. From their own 41 yard line. It's second down and two to go. They're in the eye. with the tackle at the 44. And that run will move the chain. Oh boy, that was a tough one to give up for that defense. No question, not only couldn't they stop him, now they have to contend with this clock as well. Looks like someone went a little too far with the celebration. Unsportsmanlike conduct on the offense. 15 yard penalty, first down. They line up at the 29. First down. The Badger line up with two tight ends. Great hit with the fullback. And down he goes at the 32. The fullback picks up about three yards on that carry. And it looks like we've got our Coca-Cola players of the game. Very well played game by these gentlemen. The Badger line up in an I formation. Fafita gets it on the inside. And he's taken down at 27. The handback gets the goal and picks up five. Here's a third and long situation. Ball on the 37-yard line. Wisconsin comes out with an eye formation. They hand it off again. On the third and long, they decided to run it. Well, it's not that crazy here because they have the lead in the fourth quarter, so their main focus is to keep that clock running. And this blowout is finally over. Kirk, what'd you think of this one? Well, I'm shocked by the final score. I expected this to be a close game. LSU got absolutely crushed today in this football game. I hope they can put this one past them because sometimes it's difficult for a program to bounce back after an embarrassing loss like that. That concludes another game of NCAA Football 2007. Our final score here today, Wisconsin 65, LSU 28.